all righty what's going on everybody jay baker vlogs here and welcome to the new season of the vlog series well anyway guys if you haven't seen the season finale episode to season 23 you can find it in the playlist and you are good to go anyway guys happy friday night to all that are watching this video and to all that are out and about watching star wars the last jedi Anyway, guys, uh, this year I haven't been able to go on the time that the movie released because all of the seats were sold out, the tickets were sold out. And so anyway, I have decided that this year the movie showing that I'm going is on Tuesday, December 19th. And it is at the Palladium. I will be vlogging during that day. And most likely, guys, just hanging out with my friend, maintenance worker from Sam's, Benny Contetas. Anyway, guys, I have seen a lot of spoilers out there. And anyway, I'm going to turn it over to Santa. And he is going to talk about the floating spoilers. So anyway, without further ado, let's turn it over to Santa. Alrighty, thank you, Jonathan. Thank you so much. Hey there, everybody. Your pal St. Nicholas here. And welcome to the next episode of the vlog series. Well, good to see y'all again this evening. I know a lot of y'all are just busy running around, maybe even watching a movie. I know tonight is Star Wars night. Tonight is the night The Last Jedi is out in all theaters. Well, Jonathan and I were talking in the hallway. And Jonathan showed me. He's like, hey, Santa, have you ever seen anything suspicious about spoilers? I was like, well... I have seen a YouTube channel that was saying how he liked it or how somebody didn't like it. Instead, they're giving out spoilers to those that have not watched the movie. And to those that really want to go see it, but now the person that's on the internet is giving out spoilers. It makes me not want to watch the movie because they're putting it out there and saying, oh, we like the movie because of this scene. Or we like the movie because of that scene. Man, I, I really wish that... Mm, Jiminy Christmas, I don't know what to do! I feel like I want to bang my head on the wall or, or literally just sneak into somebody's apartment... The guys that put the spoilers out there and fill their stockings with rocks and charcoal for Christmas. But y'all are probably saying, well, Santa, isn't that a little too harsh? What's harsh about it? These guys put out spoilers while we didn't see the movie. You know, like, I feel like I just want to bang my head on the wall. I don't know what to tell you guys. But I just feel like I want to bang my head on the wall. So, I'm going to grab a camera and just start banging my head on the wall. Ow. Okay. Okay, that's enough. Uh, so, you guys know my point of view. That spoilers, if you spoil a movie and somebody hasn't watched a movie, that's just still spoiling it. Jonathan's friend, Duncan, is like, well, if you go watch the movie, don't be putting spoilers on Facebook and literally on social media about, oh, what happened in this scene? Oh, what happened in that scene? I mean, my goodness, people. 
Like Jonathan's uncle always says, come on now, get real. Well, I banged my head on that closet door for one reason, because there is spoilers out there. I mean, I'm sorry if I make somebody angry about, oh, you know, about spoilers and for us not watching the film while somebody else talks about it and they're giving out spoilers. So, anyway, Jonathan has also told me that he's got his tickets on Tuesday night when his stepbrother has got them tomorrow morning at 3 a.m. in the morning. And Jonathan was like, Santa, you know, I have put tickets on this day and they asked him to work this day and still ugh, they have to make him work and all that. <laughs> mm. I'm sorry. My hair gets in my beard. And it gets into my mouth. So anyway. I just thought I wanted to tell you guys that. And I'm sorry if I yank your chains. And you say, oh Santa, don't be mean to those that give spoilers. They just love the movie. While none of us have not seen the movie or watched it for short, and somebody else has to give out spoilers and I have to bang my head on the wall and just, just like that, you know, just making sure that I'm not dreaming. I'm not dreaming. Somebody is out giving out spoilers, thinking, oh, this scene's really good. Oh, that scene's really good. Oh, what happens next? Oh, I feel like I just want to <clears throat> bang my head on the wall. Now, a lot of y'all are saying, oh, calm down, Santa, calm down. I mean, the chance will come. You're right, the chance will come. But let me tell y'all this. Jonathan is going to be filming on Tuesday the day that he goes out and watches it with his friend. And, and I'm probably going to be out with him watching it. Or maybe, I don't know when I got my ticket. But, I will be watching the movie while I'm here in San Antonio. But anyway, just a friendly word of advice. Don't ever put spoilers, because spoilers, while nobody else watches it, that's just being a rotten egg or a rotten tomato. That's just spoiling the film that nobody has watched as of yet. But now, there's a lot of people tonight that are at Regal Cinemas or the Palladium or anywhere all the all the 50 states that have movie theaters that are watching The Last Jedi and a lot of stuff but anyway well I'm gonna go ahead and turn it over to to Jonathan I know He's got my scrumptious, delicious cookies already out of the oven. Mm -mm -mm. I can't wait to taste them. Anyway, guys, check you back later. And always remember, never share spoilers to a movie that you have never, ever seen. But somebody else probably saw it and they're doing the same thing. So, anyway, we'll see y'all back later. Okay then, wow. Thanks Santa for that lovely advice. Um, anyway, that last part in his message tonight 
was if somebody sees a movie and they share spoilers and nobody else watched it, then that, uh, that is a Rotten Tomato or whatever you call that. But anyway. But hey, his message is really good. It is clear that he wants to put Roxy Cool in their stockings. But, you know, he's not going to do that. I just ain't going to let him. It's already too late now. And people will be like, are we bad this year? Am I on the naughty list? Well, come to think of it, uh, might, uh, I don't know. You just might be on the naughty list, but you guys are probably laughing at him saying, ha ha, he's a nut and stuff, but no, he, he does make sense most of the time, you know, but anyway. Ah, uh, guys, I know, uh, a lot of y'all are out watching the new movie and stuff, and I know you guys are having fun. I wish I could be out there having fun, but I have to wait till Tuesday to watch the movie. I know tonight is opening night for The Last Jedi, and all seats and all tickets, everything is sold out. And literally, guys, um... They sell out pretty quick when it comes to the opening night. And, you know, I checked the Fandango app and all the seats in the Palladium during the night of opening night, all those seats were already sold out. Tickets were already sold out to the first showing of The Last Jedi. But anyway, for those that are having fun, just always remember... Be safe, make wise choices, have a good time, you know, and always remember to stay positive, to always just, just have a good time. That's all I'm saying. Ah, boy, howdy. Mm. Anyway, guys, be safe, make some wise choices, may the force be with you, and we will see you guys Back here, probably Sunday. <laughs> I, I don't know what day I'll be vlogging and stuff. But anyway, we'll see y'all back later. <laughs>